everyone, and welcome back to some more Yes, Your Grace. I'm recording this immediately after the last episode, so that's why my voice sounds a little bit more um, worn out, but that's fine. I'm excited. So in the last episode, we managed to kind of stop a fight between our daughters. Um, hopefully that ends up going well, because we took some time to talk to both of them. We are going to fix the pantry roof that is causing damage to all our supplies. We're going to fix the market stall. So we gain an extra two gold per week, which is pretty great. And then we're going to repair the theater because I'm a theater kid at heart. So you know what? That is pretty great. So we're going to save and continue and see what the next week brings us. But I am super loving this game so far. I don't know how long this game actually is, um, but that's fine. Oh, gosh, look at everyone. Uh, you know what? I'm going to call my wife first because I love her. I bring news, father. Oh, that's not my wife. Oh, my God. I keep confusing my daughter for my wife. Ah, um, I bring news, father. It's Alia sneaked out last night, or at night last week. Oh no! I ran into her while she was going back to her chambers, all laughing and a little tipsy. <gasps> no, my daughter? No, I. <laughs> uh, she wouldn't say where she's. See, this is why I like quarantine. I've been spending too much time alone for this. Uh, she wouldn't say where she's been, but Sadini, as sick as she is, spilled everything to me in the morning. Those two chit chat all the time. I, uh, they think I don't realize. Uh, thick. Don't speak ill of your sister. What's gotten into you? Oh, she's probably jealous of their bond, actually. Um, Azalea sneaks out to some wedding, gets all drunk, but I'm the bad one all of a sudden. Audrey, did you know about any of this? Uh, know your grace? Uh, I'd better talk to Azalea about this. Interesting. Okay, well, I'll for sure talk to- I'll see what's going on, because our daughters shouldn't be, like, sneaking out, getting drunk. Like, that's not why I had them. Ooh, who is this? A banker. Uh, um, oh, a lord. We'll talk to the lord first. My name is Etten. Uh, I'm the lord of Branca, your grace. I will be straightforward as possible. Someone has kidnapped my daughter. <gasps> and they expect me to pay 12 gold to get her back. Thing is, I track them down and I know where they are keeping her. I planned everything out. I just need your general to help me get her back. Or I could just pay the ransom. Either way, I will need your help, your grace. Oh, no. I don't have... Oh, God, I don't have enough supplies for this. Ugh. Oh, God, this gives me anxiety. I'm s I'll give you a general. I don't oh, no. I'm sorry, I can't help. I don't have it. My general is occupied and my gold is running low. I wish you the best luck in getting your daughter back. And I wish you never find yourself in a similar situation. Keep your daughter safe, your grace. Oh, no, he will remember this. Oh, it's like the Telltale games all over again. Oh, minus two happiness. Yeah, I'm sure. Yikes. Um, oh, I could have... Well, I only have one general, so I wouldn't have been able to do it anyway. Your grace, there is no sign of monsters. We did stumble upon these bandits, so they were pillaging the village. Uh, redhead sharp teeth. The crest of Radovia. I thought you could only find them in books or old manuscripts. Well, it seems like we have one right here, too. Tell me... Um, who, uh, why are you here? Yeah. What are you and your men doing near the village? We're just making a living. One man might call it plunder. I would call it hard work. Oh, yikes. Uh, whose banner are you bearing? Is it true that you're from Rodovia? Your man is right. Rodovia is my home. And soon yours too. Oh, good. Who's your leader? Uh, do you have a king? Uh, we are free people. We don't bow to kings or lords. Bold wars for someone trespassing in another country. Bold and stupid. I've heard enough. Your grace, we can't allow barbarians to start our lands. Uh, plundering and killing innocent men. There's no question that justice needs to be dealt with. Oh, shoot! I could straight up kill a dude. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, We're just gonna throw him in the dungeon. Because I don't think killing a dude is the best answer to this. We're just gonna throw him in the dungeon. You will rot in a cell. Uh, don't want to let me go, but you don't have the guts to kill me. My friends will gladly hear about your cowardly decision. What? I need to tell Aurelia about this. Yeah, I do. What the ever living? What do you make of this? Uh, Rodovians here. Uh, how would they get through the mountains? Why would they threaten war? There's a lot of questions, but I need my answers, Audrey. Forgive me, Your Grace. I'm just puzzled. Might be reasonable to start thinking about renewing some old treaties. Ooh. Talk to old friends, see who could give us a hand. Interesting. With our current resources, a war would bring certain defeat. I agree. I will make some preparations. So we do know for sure there's going to be a war, because that was the start of the game. 
Interesting. Uh, we'll talk to a banker real quick. I'm here representing Bank de Florentini, Your Grace. I hear that your treasury has seen better times, but I'm here to help. Ooh, how does this work? Uh, we understand that sometimes it's hard to be king and we want to do our best help. We offer quick and easy solutions. Okay, so it's basically a loan system, I think. Offers 50 gold or supplies instantly available for use. Uh, to, depending on the type of loan. It's paid off weekly until you pay your debt. We won't charge you any additional costs. One last thing to note, we only do one type of loan at a time. So we're good on supplies, I think. We really, really need... Uh, the first loan is free of charge. Just pay back what you like. I want to borrow gold because we are very low. See, I wish... I wish I knew the order of what to do this. I think we did this in the wrong order. I think we gotta accept the people as they come up to us, because otherwise we could have helped that guy. I remember the first zone is free of charge. Yeah, I will take it for sure. Anything else, Your Grace? Um, you know what? That's it for now. Thank you. Uh, okay, they're always happy to help. Cool. Peasant. Uh, Your Grace, my dear son is nowhere to be found. Yes, a really daft little boy, but still he is my son. I ask you to help us find him, Your Grace. Is there any chance you could do so? Um... Our general will try and find your son. Okay, so that's two weeks is what that is. You know what? We're going to offer some gold for that. Your grace, you really think that gold can replace my son? I better look for help elsewhere. Oh, jeez. Oh, I feel like I'm just a bad king. Pietro? Oh, from like the Avengers. Cute. Your grace, I fear for my life. I think someone is trying to get me. What's going on? I think someone is following me. They want me dead. Who's they? I don't know. How would I know? I haven't done anything, right? I better be going. Okay. Well, that looks like it for, like, the throne duty. I feel like we failed this week. I do not think we did well at all. Um, but let's go to the gardens. Let's see who we can talk to here. Oh, it's... Oh, yeah. It's time to confront our daughter. Yes, father. Uh, so there was a wedding in the village. I heard there was quite a fine wedding in the village just outside our walls. It wasn't bad, but I heard it could have been better if my father was a little bit less stingy. Oh, no. This goes back to week one. Oof. Oh, no. Um, I wish you'd come and ask me first. I'm not angry. I just want you to be safe. Why would you be mad? Is it because I went to the market? Come on now. I know about the wedding. Or Sulia told me what happened. How would she know anyway? Oh, of course. Sidani. Sidani. Um, I have too much on my head. You're too careless. I'm just worried about her. Um, I wouldn't forgive myself if I let anything happen to you. You have no need to worry. Nothing will happen. Don't you know what's out there? Uh, what could have happened if someone found a princess in, by herself in a village? I can't talk right now. Oh, the drunkard sugs. Nothing happened, father. I was dressed differently. I was careful. I'm not stupid. I know what I was doing. All I wanted was a little bit of fun. She's like Princess Jasmine. Uh, Lorcilia said you got drunk. That's a lie. I know what I'm doing and I can take care of myself. How many times? Ugh. Ursulia. Since she's turned 13, she thinks that you will make her marry some fat, dumb prince and send her off to another castle. If she intends to be such a lousy rat, maybe it would be for the best. Oof. Oh, sorry, I skipped that. Uh, I suppose so. It doesn't change the fact that she's just infuriating. And it doesn't change the fact that you didn't stop with the name calling. You were confined to the castle. Um, ooh, no more horse riding. No more visits to the market seems pretty. Uh, no more visits to the market. You will not be visiting the market. What am I supposed to do in these godforsaken walls? Ugh, stupid Lucilia. I'll teach her a lesson. Stop with the names. Uh, okay. Gosh, that was... I don't feel like we're doing well in this game. I might have to do a second run through, like stream it or something. Um, let's talk to... Ooh, bedchamber. I'm sure someone's in here. Uh, okay. It is our loving wife. Hello. Hi, friend. Darling. Ooh, okay. Sorry, I was talking like a mile a minute, and I just needed to get some water and calm down a little bit. Uh, but anyway, foreign barbarians visited us this week. Uh, Redonians have come to Davern. One of the bandits was brought to the castle. Redovians? That can't be right. Do you think it's about your our promise? It might be what- ooh, what promise? What do you think? This is also a really nice bedchamber. Like, look, they got like marble looking floors. Like, they're all shiny and stuff. Thirteen years ago, we promised our unborn child's hand to a thug. <gasps> what? Ew! A baron, wasn't it? Doesn't matter. After thirteen years, a Rodovian shows up in our castle. I'll be damned. Uh, yes, yeah, so Ursulia will soon become a woman, and we need to find her a husband. And Baron, the villain, uh, will arrive to make me fulfill my promise. Uh, what about the, what about the witch? Do you remember the curse? I don't even want to think about this. Let's just hope the curse is nothing but a hoax. Oh, they're never just a hoax, honey. Have you seen Sleeping Beauty? No. 
and see how things with the thug turn out. Uh, what's gotten into us? How could we have promised our daughter's hand to a Rodovian? Oh! So it's not like cut off her hand like I was thinking. It's just like a marriage pact. I mean, would that be like the worst thing? Uh, with a knife to my throat, I'm not sure what else we could have done. To think our daughter will marry some barbaric thug, though. We can't let this happen. Can we promise our second daughter? Because, like, our second daughter seems more likely to marry a thug. Like, she just seems a little bit too wild for us. Don't worry, we will solve this. Uh, yeah, what now? What are we gonna do? If Bayron ever shows up to claim our daughter's hands, hopefully no one will believe him. We just need to play stupid. Unless he shows up with an army. Oh, this is the war. This is what's gonna happen. Uh, don't be silly now. How could a commoner afford an army, even if we can't? How could Rodovians even get in, Stavin? Or Davrin? Uh, anything seems possible at this stage. I agree. Uh, did you send the bandit to the dungeons? Maybe you could question him. Okay, see, so I did make a good decision. We are thriving. It's okay. I'll see what I can do. Uh, oh, how are you holding up? I, I don't know. It's so unreal. Marrying a prince, a lord even? Yes, but to let her marry a thug? We can't do this. It'll be fine. I won't let them take her away. Um, I'll see you later, darling. Eric, I'm terrified. I can handle this. Uh, fine. I will stay here. Okay, cool. Oh, can we ch change her appearance in mirror? Damn, I look so tired. Me too. Me too. Or maybe I'm just old. Also me. I'm only 23, but gosh, I feel like I'm 50. We'll go to the dungeon. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, we have the peasant in here too. I thought we fixed up the dungeon. I thought we could like have some other people here. Did we not fix this up? How can I help your grace? I'm just looking around. I thought we fixed this. Does it? Oh, it probably takes a few weeks to fix. I don't think a king would come down to the dungeons and honor truly. Uh, enough of the games. Tell me what you know. Why are you here? I suppose that's one way of killing uh, time in this murky den. You see, Byron, that lunatic, thinks everyone will follow him. Keeps raving about some promise. One of the seven kings will give him his daughter. Oh, one of the seven kings. Okay. So it doesn't necessarily have to be me, from what I'm getting. He thinks he's got a chance to uh, a mingling with the royals. I still can't decide. Is he the mad one, or is it his followers who believe this bunk, who are really insane? Um, that's all for now. Okay, okay, okay. Mm, your grace. Okay, have you considered letting me out? The gods must have spared my life for a reason, you know. Yeah, you've had enough. You can, you can leave. Hope you learned your lesson. You may leave. What, really? The gods have truly chosen me. Um, it's mainly because we have, like, no space in this place. Our past will cross again. I can feel it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you go ahead and leave. That's fine. Okay. So, I think we have one more place. Yeah, the castle walls. I think our daughter's probably- Oh, hello, friend. Hi, General. Your Grace? Uh, that's all. Okay. Well, I guess we can't really talk to him. I feel- Gosh, I wish we could have helped a few more people, but- Oh, so let's pet the cat again, because that was fun. <laughs> Those fields used to be covered in forces. Our agriculture is thriving. Interesting. It's weird to think that there's going to be, like, archers and a whole war up here and everything at some point. Uh, but we will talk to our daughter. Oof, what's that smell? Is that you, Dusty? Mur well, it wasn't me. Oh my gosh. Oh, we got an achievement for that. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, it's you. Azalea told me what's going on. Uh, that you might be feeling a little bit down recently. I think your mother and I had started figuring it out anyway. I'm sorry we didn't realize earlier. Oh, and why is that? You won't have to marry a stranger. Oh, you won't have to- Ooh, oof. Oh, no. You know what? We really gotta pick, like, what we're gonna prioritize in this thing. And I, I'm leaning more towards family. Because that just, like, resonates a little bit deeper with me. Sorry, my voice is just, like, going out at this point. Uh, you won't have to marry a stranger. Uh, tradition says a girl your age needs to find a husband, but I promise you won't have to marry a stranger. We will make sure you know the prince well before the wedding. Mm, time will show. Okay, goodbye, awkward turtle. Okay, so let's see if we can't... Oh, I guess we have to head downstairs to be able to access, like, the little panel of stuff. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so I want to see the archives. Um, so we need Rodovian Bite, um... Yeah, so he promised his older daughter. I figured a peasant asked for gold to build a new inn for their village. Yeah, so I told him I'd pay for it. That's fine. Um, he left in a hurry. Yeah, he didn't give... Oh, so it was a lord who visited. Okay. Um, yeah, that's fine. Uh, okay. So we, we know all this. I'm just kind of 
going through this. Cool, so let's go ahead and call it a week and see what we have. So we said that we were gonna do all this stuff. Um, so I guess it's just gonna take some time, maybe? The problem is, like, I don't know why it's not going. Uh, like, why we can't... Like, why isn't this fixed? <laughs> but, uh, I think we're gonna save and continue. We're kinda out of time for this episode. I'm trying to keep them pretty short. For oh, look! There's a little pigeon! We'll save this for next episode, so thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, the whole shebang, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. So until then, bye!